a lot of ideas about what actually happens in the courtroom based on watching TV and watching, you know, popular shows, movies. And in reality, there is a lot of difference in what the actual uh, courtroom and process looks like. On a lot of television shows, you will see a police detective go and actually maybe go to a forensics lab or go to uh, see a, a, a dead body in the morgue. That is not something that actually typically would ever happen. There are reports that are created and those are the things that the, the attorneys would go off of. It's Of course, it's dramatic to see the police officers or the attorneys go and actually look at the evidence, but in reality, you know, we there, there's, there are not field trips to the morgue for these people. This is that's something that takes place by the forensic specialists, and then they put, put together reports that actually have all of the information that's needed. A very common one is we see a, a district attorney actually walking into the jail and talking to a defendant. In reality, the district attorney, him or herself, is not going to do that. There are lawyers that actually work on the cases, and they're the ones that would negotiate. The DA himself or herself would not be involved in that process. So we see that it's a an attention grab in the entertainment media to see that if you you know a lot of popular tv shows show those da's going in there but that's really not reality that's very atypical what we see on on the television shows you know we want to wrap it up in one episode it's not something that's going to go uh you know on and on it's not going to drag out typically you'll you'll see what looks like a whole court case that maybe takes place in just a few minutes and re reality is that that almost never happens unless it's a very very minor uh like an infraction or a very very minor crime anything that is going to go to trial trial is going to be pretty drawn out and especially those serious charges and cases can can lead to months and months of uh, hearings and then actually the trial itself can be very very drawn out. On courtroom TV shows we often see a cross-examination take place and it's it's typically something that has some you know dramatic points that really engage the viewer and are interesting and and, and draw them in but they typically are really short and then the the attorney will rest the case. The reality is that a cross-examination is a pretty excruciating thing to watch, especially in a bigger, high-profile case. It can take hours, it can take days even in some cases to cross-examine a witness, and the attorneys have to stop and focus on every little detail to ensure that the trial record reflects that this point was proven adequately. So the reality is that you would not typically see a an attorney go into this process and ask a few questions and then rest the case. That's just not how it usually works. Another issue that comes up a lot is uh, friction among the parties in a criminal case. So a lot of the time we see the opposing attorneys um, really going after each other, police detectives who clearly don't like the defense attorney. Uh, in reality, the the it's a working group. These people work together on on many many cases. They have you know personal relationships. Sometimes they certainly have professional relationships to maintain, and they're usually not bitter enemies. There's not a, a miserable kind of interaction that is typical. And we see a lot of that. Of course, it's dramatic, and that's what you see on television. But the reality is that these people are working to to you know, get a common result that everybody needs to, to achieve, which is to work the case out. Um, even when there are negotiated pleas, the, the parties all work together in that process. Judge characters are people who are very, very harsh and authoritative. We see a lot of banging the gavel and, you know, bringing an unruly courtroom to order. And that, of course, makes great television and it's very dramatic and, and interesting and engaging. But in reality, the, the judge typically is not super, you know, argumentative, doesn't doesn't really go after people. And it's very, very unusual to, to pound the gavel. I don't, I've, I've almost very, very rarely seen that um, in, in the real world. So that's something that we see on TV and it's fun to watch, but it's just really not reality.